Hold on, a couple shots. He's gonna be dead. We got him godlike. I'm trying to stay alive in this for as long. Oh my gosh! So he actually helped me survive longer. Whoa! See ya, pal. Okay, so I have a pretty crazy build for you guys today. The Dagon with six needle weapons or the six harpoon weapons. I've seen a couple of players run this on the battlefield and I thought, you know what? Let's take a closer look at this because I'm sure there's a reason why. And uh, you know, when you think about it, the needle weapon actually gives you uh, 12,240 uh, additional Aegis shield if you have it maxed out. Uh, this is on top of the fact that the uh, Dagon has a very strong Aegis shield. So this might actually work. I mean, there's a reason why they're running it. So we've got to try it out. And uh, I think what I'm going to do, we're going to run two games with this build. And then right at the end, I'll go through the entire setup with things like the modules, pilot skills and stuff. And uh, my thoughts on it. And uh, with that said, I guess let's drop into game number one. So uh, we're going to get some beacons here. I'm not sure what this guy is in. Probably a Typhon or a Mars, I'm guessing. Oh boy. I can actually shoot through his shield. I just realized that now. Which means I can counter other Dagons and also the Aphian. Uh... What do they have back? Okay, so they have an Archo here. I think he's gonna... His ability has ended. We might be able to kill him. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, don't push me into a line of fire, dude. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Man, that guy lost his Archo straight off the bat. Sorry, not sorry. Why are we struggling to get this beacon? Oh, wait. Ah, he's going for me. Okay, I'm going to move this way. We have a lot of, uh, we have a lot of archos on that side. I have to kind of be careful here. There's another one in front of me. His ability is going to wear off. Which means we can pierce through his shield too. I just realized that. He's looking around, wondering what's going on. He's Dante's last hand. I'm going to get onto this beacon here. Um, I did heal. But I can't... Hold on. I can't hit him yet. His ability is still up. I think we got him. We got him. Nice. Trying to go after this Ravana here. Yes. Oh, we have to go for that Typhon. Couple of players here we can take out. They just dropped in with the Rook too. So I have to kind of be careful of that guy. Oh my gosh, my health. Release my shield. Wait, what is my... Oh, we, we are at 95 stacks. <laughs> just being really annoying. You know what? We need to get beacons though. I just realized. And there's a Dagon in front of me. Look at this. He's not gonna... Hold on. A couple of shots. He's gonna be dead. We got him. Godlike. This guy's knocking down my shield really quickly. I'm trying to get this guy here. Beyond Godlike. What the? Is he gonna drop in here? Oh, he did with a Fenrir. But you know what? I'm kind of charged up here. That Fenrir is going down fast. Living legend. Let me try to help out my buddy over here on this beacon. By the way, apologies for the micro freezes, guys. I do realize it's kind of lagging pretty bad. And I get this guy down to his last end. Okay, so his ability has worn off. Just waiting for his... Uh... Hold on, hold on. I can't hit him yet. We shouldn't be hitting him. We're making him stronger. I'm trying to get onto the beacon too. Yes, I think we can get him now. There we go. Oh shoot, I didn't see this guy. He's trying to he's trying to kill me. Yikes! There's another one over here. Oh, is that the same guy? No, there's two rooks. Yeah, this is not working. Let me just back away here. Holy jeez, my health is gonna drop fast. Yeah, we need to go, we need to go for beacons instead. I'm trying to stay alive in this for as long... Oh my gosh! He's gone. I'm trying to stay alive in this uh, Dagon for as long as possible. Uh, 
He's gonna he's looking for me. The thing is I can hit him right through his shield. Oh my gosh, he's dead. That is crazy. Wait, what's hitting me? I just gotta keep on pushing beacons, yep. I just hope my teammates are able to uh, defend against that back there. We have a couple of titans and stuff in our spawn. Um, there is a... Uh, there's a Newton here. Maybe we can kill him with this. I mean, it's pretty powerful. I'm still within range, so we still are hitting him. I have a last stand, but that may not help much here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yikes! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm definitely not gonna survive this. No ways! Okay, there's a lot of guys there. Um, jeez. What am I gonna... Uh, you know what? Ocho. That's probably the best thing. We actually need to go for the other beacon, our home beacon. I'm trying to get rid of their, their Newton first. And then maybe we can focus on this uh, Rook. I need to charge up my um, my mothership here. Ooh, jeez, my health. If I can take out maybe another Rook, that would be good. Or at least a Rook with this. Take out a Titan. Isn't it crazy how this uh, Otto can just tank damage like that? That is something that really should not be allowed. Okay, so we have a couple of beacons here. Um, I'm going to drop in on this side. I'm going to have to target the Rook. You know what's kind of unfortunate here? Is the fact that... Uh, I wasn't able to get my um, my Titan Repair Amps charged up. If I was able to, I think I would have been able to at least defend a little bit better against that. Uh, this guy here, can we get him? I'm just trying to hold down beacons, but I don't know if we're going to actually end up winning here. Because kind of the odds are against me. They have a lot more players. But we had a pretty good run with the, uh, with the Dagon. I think we might have been down. I think we might have been down like a player or so. Because so we kind of bought it out very quickly. I'm trying to alternate my uh, shield here. But that only helps me so much when you're dealing with this amount of firepower. Uh, we have one more. Yep. This is my last bot. And that's going to be it. So that is the first game. You know what? I'm pretty impressed though by the Dagon. There's a lot of things you can counter. Get this guy and that is going to be it so i think we might have been down a player i don't know our team just kind of crumbled but you know what it might also be because i was in my dagon for too long usually when you see titans like that you want to kind of ditch your uh, bots and drop in with the titan uh, but we did get 10.6 million 12 kill six beacons and uh, this is how we stacked up i think and one guy definitely has a crisis Oh my gosh, we almost killed that player. I'm gonna go after this uh, this Typhon here. Get rid of him. Maybe uh, maybe this guy here too. He's gone into phase ship, but that's not going to save him. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! Yikes! Crisis Reaper. Crisis Reaper. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. No. Oh my gosh, this hop is dead. There's no way he's dead. That guy's dead too. And I can pierce through the Dagon shield. He's dead. Godlike. I need to get I need to get to this side here because they have that uh they have that crisis. I need to get to him. 
And if this guy goes into flight because he has a Favnir, it's not going to matter because guess what? We can pierce through his, uh, his shield too. This guy's dead. Living legend. Man, this is one very nasty build. The thing is, you have to get within range though. There's a lot of Typhons here, jeez. Oh my gosh. This guy's going to use his ability soon. Just trying to get him uh, to use that ability. This guy blinded me. Oh jeez, I'm taking a lot of damage here. Let's just do that. He's going to be down to his last stand. This guy's going to be dead. Last stand on him. I lost a weapon, but still... That's a really good run with this build. Uh-oh. 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 Whoa! Oh, thank you. <laughs> he actually allowed me to... Because uh... now I can use the, the mothership and regain some of that great damage. So he actually helped me survive longer. Whoa! See ya, pal! <laughs> Hold on, hold on. I'm just waiting. This guy's um, ability is going to wear off here. Oh, oh he has harpoon weapons too. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm trying to get this beacon. Oh, he got it. There we go. That was a crazy run though with the uh, the Dagon. Once I got into the spawn, oh my gosh, that thing's quite terrifying. I guess this is going to be a spawn raid here because that's a lot of Newtons back there. Let's deal with this guy here so he can't uh, EMP my uh, teammate. Definitely don't want that. And now we go for the Newtons back here. Oh jeez, another one? What the? Three Newtons. Yeah, that's bad news for them. Definitely bad news. There goes one. There goes another one. And I think we got the third one as well. So, yeah. I'm going to show you the entire build now. Um, you know, for this Dagon uh, Needle build. Let's just take a look at the uh, score here. So 12 kills, 2 beacons, 5.9, almost 6 million. And uh, let's just go back. And uh, this is the entire build here. So here are the Needle weapons. A couple of stats. And uh, we have actually two nuclear amplifiers, last stand, unstable conduit, the Seeker drone, which is going to help. Um, you know, one thing with this uh, drone as well, durability and energy shield durability uh, is increased. I think uh, they have it at 10%. There we go. Why is this as a shield drone description? I guess they kind of messed up there. Um, so we have that. Uh, we also have this pilot. You know, the following skills. And I believe I was running the paladin. Okay, so that allows me to heal up some of that great damage. So we have this. I guess you could also take it a step further if you want and then apply the Aegis Shield uh, turret. Uh, but I think this build, or at least this combination, is a lot stronger. Uh, but yeah, in the comment section, guys, let me know if there's anyone out there currently running this build or something similar. Or maybe you want to see, like, I don't know, I think I saw someone wanting to see, like, the regular punishes uh, on the Dagon. Let me know in the comment section down below. And with that said, Thank you guys for watching, stay safe, and until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.